and a very good evening. Welcome to the 2020 graduation here at the Titusville Municipal Airport. Luke Rio, Crystal Gates, Assistant Principal of Titusville High School with us. Hey, Crystal, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Congratulations. Thank you. Another successful year. It has been. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> so we're pretty excited to have the graduation out here at the airport and beautiful evening. This morning we were a little nervous when we were setting up. But as you can see, it's a beautiful blue skies and the sun is out. We're ready. Well, Crystal, we're going to be getting to the Star Spangled Banner here at the uh, top of the hour. But let's kind of backtrack a little bit. It's a big anniversary for Titusville High School. Mm -hmm. It is. It's 150th graduating class of Titusville High School. So a pretty, bu pretty big event. Um, all the graduates received medals commemorating that. Um, which was a present from the school board, which I thought was pretty nice. So a lot of history to celebrate, and this class has, you know, had to deal with a lot, and, you know, we're trying to make it as special as we can. It's amazing when you look back at the start of the year, uh, you guys were given um, a nice presentation by uh, Representative Kathy, Kathy Rapp at uh, Homecoming. Mm -hmm. And if uh, you didn't get a chance to see that, let's revisit that from back in October. I'm very honored to be here tonight with the superintendent of the Titusville School District, Superintendent Stephanie Keebler, and the principal of Titusville High School, Phil Knapp, and the assistant principal, Crystal Gates, to present to Titusville uh, School District a citation. And these citations are something that we uh, present for very special occasions and this is definitely a special occasion for Titusville and Titusville School District. So I will read most of this citation and then we'll be presenting it to the school district. Whereas the House of Representatives of Pennsylvania takes great pleasure in recognizing those educational facilities which contribute to the benefit of their communities and ultimately to all the citizens of this Commonwealth. And whereas Titusville High School is being honored upon the momentous occasion of its 150th anniversary, and whereas established in 1869, 